All right, continuing The Last of Us. If you're watching this later on YouTube, thanks for clicking how you've been enjoying so far. I just had to do a brief intermission, so. This is part of a longer VOD. I just wanted to adjust things ever so slightly. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. They said they were doing maintenance on my internet connection. And, uh, it definitely shows. Who's waiting for us at the drop off? She said there's some fireflies that traveled all the way from another city. They're almost being important. What is the deal with you? You some big wig's daughter or something? Something like that. How long is this all gonna take? If everything goes as planned, we should get you to them in a few hours. Ellie, once we We're not gonna go as planned, most likely. <laughs> Come on up. Come on, kid. Watch your step. <laughs> this rain ain't gonna do us any good. Holy shit. Call up. I'm actually outside. This way. This looks pretty nice. Dolph oh, shit. Stupid. <laughs> Move. Well. Turn around on your knees. You scan them, I'll call it in. Okay. Put your hands on your head. I thought I was being careful. This is Ramirez at Sector 12, requesting pickup for three stragglers. Understood. Look the other way. We can make this worth your while. Shut up. Tired of shit. Mm-hmm. What's the ETA? Couple minutes. <laughs> oh, shit. Damn, kid. Fucking hell. Fuck. I thought we were just gonna hold him up or something. Holy shit. Look. Jesus Christ. She's infected. Marlene set us up? Why the hell are we smuggling an infected girl? I'm not infected. No? She's lying. I can explain. You better explain fast. Look at this. I don't care how you got infected. It's three weeks old. No, everyone turns within two days, so you stop bullshitting. It's three weeks. I swear. Why would she set you up? Hmm. I ain't buying it. Immunity. Go! Go! Move! Holy shit! I got two dead uniforms. I repeat, I got Follow me. Quickly. We couldn't loot them. They probably had guns. Oh, fuck. Alright, Ellie. When I give you the signal, we run. Signal. Run. 
Bad up. Stop. Jeez. I don't know where I'd be without her, honestly, Tess. <laughs> it doesn't auto crouch, just one. Runs into the wall. It's fine. I see him, I see him. It must have gotten through. Check the trenches. Okay. Stay back. I don't see anything down there. Are we sure they came this way? Just keep scanning. Stay down, don't let him see you. Come on, kid. Follow Joel. Follow Joel? Jeez, no, 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 no. Oh, there, there, there. I see, I see, I see, I see. I see. You see that? Show yourself. I don't think there's any easy way to do this. I'm trying to see like what I'm looking at, but all right, fuck it. Go, go, go. <laughs> nope, that didn't work. <laughs> kind of worked. Say that. It's okay. It's okay. Patience. Oh shit. They can see me. They can see me. Man, he just does not leave crouch quick enough. <laughs> I should have moved when I shot him. I see him, I see him. They must have gotten through. Check the trenches. Just stay back. Get him! I did unload on them. No, I know. I should have moved from that spot. Keep them occupied. Ugh, it's fine. I've made poor choices. That actually went well up until that point. I should have moved. I could have gotten... Worse. Hey, Nicto. As well, how's it going? Oh, for fuck's sake. Can I... I'm gonna... Oh, you can restart checkpoint. Sweet. Yes. Sleep is shit, but otherwise good. Oh, no. Okay, hang on. Just stay Go. back. Just wait. Are we sure they came this way? told otherwise, we just keep Is the stream behaving by the way? Like my they were saying they were doing maintenance on my internet connection tonight. Um so I'm not sure how it's been. I've heard one person say it's choppy. It looks fine, so it's not stuttering or anything? Okay, cool. Negative. Thank you for letting me know. Ah! Down there. 
You've been playing Terraria. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's fair enough. They haven't released a new update, have they? Just never did the seed, the seed, the difficult seed. I would imagine this would be so much easier. <laughs> Get fixed, boy. Oh, man. I played a little bit of that. The first hour of that seed was just suffering. I didn't really get too far in it. Okay. Are they just gonna keep coming? Keep looking. You love the rainbow stuff? Yeah. I think the hardest part of that seed is just having to deal with the hunger and there's just no food. Okay. I mean, maybe we might be able to sneak through now. You just went fishing at the start? At the Because at the start you get dropped in the lava, no? Like, the bottom. That's where I was struggling a little. It wasn't until I got a little bit further up that I was able to fish. Careful. This is tricky. Down there. Don't lose sight of him. What bosses did I do? I don't think I did one. I ran into the the Bee Queen and then the Slime King. Just had the stupid bee spawn on me so many times and then the slime king just once just randomly and just got immediately evaporated shit ah oh, fuck but beyond that i didn't really get that far into it It definitely takes a special level of patience to do that. So far, so good. Also, I think the problem was, um, what difficulty did you pick? Because I wasn't aware that. Fuck. Don't lose sight of I wasn't aware that the difficulty you picked was difficulty plus one. So I picked expert, and then that becomes master mode. So that was another reason I was having a hard time. So, that's part of the reason why I stopped playing it, was just because I don't particularly enjoy Master Mode. I don't have a good angle here. Alright, let's try another way. Clear. You don't realize that either, oh no. Alright, I think we're through. You didn't actually plan to play, oh really? Okay, well, could have gone better, but... You did it for the achievement because it was the only one you were missing. What achievement do you get for it? 
Just for playing it or for completing it? I haven't gotten all the achievements in that game. I'm missing a few. The seed one, okay. Let the clickers get them. through here. Alright, I can stop crawling, jeez. how they can run whilst crouching and I can't. <laughs> Did I see the series of this? No, I, I have no um, exposure to this at all. This is completely blind perspective. That was an awkward input. Got it. <laughs> that, that was impressive. Yeah, I got him through the wall. <laughs> Fuck me. It depends which way he's gonna go. Just give him a minute. Yep, this is why we give him a minute. Okay. Is another one going to go through the wart? Okay, okay, keep it calm. Another one dead! They're still here! Keep looking. I'm waiting for him to move up. Okay. Grab and go. <laughs> lemmings, like lemmings. Just keep following the trail of bodies to your death. <laughs> this is the this is the lemming strategy. B like breadcrumbs, make them follow the breadcrumbs to the pile of bodies. They don't learn their lessons. Like, gee, there's two bodies here. Next one comes along. Gee, there's three bodies here. Say exact same thing. The dude's gonna notice the guy at the door. He's gonna come in here, then see the two bodies, and I'm gonna take him out again. There's a body here. Bitch. Then he's gonna move forward. He's gonna see the two bodies. <laughs> Watch your six, another body over here! There's another body over here! <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa! Oh no, he ran. Oh shit, okay. Nope, I'm wrong. Alright. Clever. Smart AI. I was fully expecting him to... Okay. All right, there's another another one incoming. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Stay down. 
Hey, Colin, how's it going? How's things? How's your training stuff? Um, oh, that dude with the light. There's no other ones. Okay, I need to run across and then crouch. This was probably not smart. Okay, I guess we can ignore him. I hear something. I hear rustling. Or is that just the rain? I won't go all done with training until they get a part of the system they don't have access to yet. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah, I finished Pikmin this week, and Warrior Land 4, so now I'm on to the spooky game, which I'm probably going to suck at. But also, um, Sea of Stars, which is really good. I just started this, yeah, like a few hours ago. And then see a stars as well. Really liking see a stars. This is good too, so far. I just gotta get used to shooting with a controller because I just don't play games that involve guns and aiming <laughs> on a controller. So my aim has been horrendous. Stealth, on the other hand, I think I'm okay. Yeah, this looks right. Stay close. At least we're out of the rain. I haven't played or heard anything of this series, so. This is pretty blind for me. I think we can squeeze through here. Oh. My flashlight was... It looks cool. Yeah, I mean, the setting is like... Post-apocalyptic. So some virus... Infected people. And I guess we have this girl who's infected now, but she's fine, so she has some immunity, so we're escorting her. Stay in the shadows. Stay in the shadows, no problem. Did I like Pikmin? It was fun. Just the thing at times that got me was just how... Ugh, like, they would get stuck on things, or... Um... If I got them to carry something, they would take sometimes take the path that would lead them to an enemy. Um, so that was a little stressful, but the game is fun. Okay. Which way are we going? They're like, no. they're like little kids. Yes, they are. They stop and they eat. They get distracted by things very easily. Sure thing, boss. The second one had more colors. I'll check it out at some point for sure. It's just, my plans are to move through this and uh, see a stars, and then we got Mario. And Spider-Man 2. There's just so many games coming out right now. So this was my planned Halloween game this year. It's not on the extreme edge of horror, but it's got it. Are they following me or do I need to go further in that room? Why are you guys still here? I don't do Halloween though. We do, just not to the same extent that it's celebrated in America. Um, 
people have Halloween parties, but it's not like a, oh, everyone has to have one practically. And, you know, you don't go trick-or-treating really. Kids do in some neighborhoods, but it's not like a universal thing. It's, it just depends. Yes. Here it's got it's gotten a lot bigger over the years, um, but you know when I was a kid, it just never happened. Whoa, 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 whoa. Jesus. Shadows. I mean, they would hear the splashing around, but it's fine, we can ignore that. Alright, there you go. Look, what was the plan? Let's say that we deliver you to the Fireflies. What then? Marlene's... She said that they have their own little quarantine zone with doctors they're still trying to find a cure. Yeah, we've heard that before, huh, Tess? Hmm. Whatever happened to me is the key to finding a vaccine. Oh, Jesus. It's what she said. Oh, I'm sure she did. Well, fuck you, man. I didn't ask for this. Me neither. Tess, what the hell are we doing here? What if it's true? I can't... What if, Joel? I mean, we've come this far, let's... His backstory is when this shit went down. He had a daughter, and he was trying to save her, and then the army... ...got... ...the call to shoot up civilians to keep them quarantined, so... ...he got shot, so did his daughter, his daughter died. This so he's, he's a bit of a cold man now. Because this is 20 years later. And he's still traumatized by that because he's just, he's still wearing the watch his daughter gave him, even though it doesn't work. Just a little a little bit of context for you. Holy moly! I guess this is what these buildings look like up close. They're so damn tall. So what happened here? Bomb the hell out of the surrounding areas to the quarantine zones, hoping to kill as much of the infected as possible. There you go. Uh, what the hell was that? Tess, you hear that? Yeah. It sounded pretty far away, though. <laughs> Are we safe? For now. Is this a series or one game? It's two games. And it's also a TV show. They've adapted it into a TV show. At least this part, this game they've adapted into a TV show. I haven't seen the TV show or played the games. Damn, it's quite a drop. This is a game that's one of those, like, people say it's a must play. Yeah, we need to get around this mess. This is the downtown area? It was. Now it's a giant wasteland. Clearly, any of you. That's okay, I haven't. <laughs> it's fine. A lot of people haven't. This was a PlayStation exclusive for the PS3, I believe. Then it got remastered on the PS4, and now it's remastered again on the PS5. So I have the PS5 version. And then, you know, they have the sequel, which came out for the PS4. Hey, Tess! Coming! But it's. Oh, that looked weird. It's been ripped apart. Shit. Alright, we might... Is that bad? Yeah, it might be. Let's not stick around. We're gonna get into our first encounter, most likely, here. Shit. 
Oh, I see. What is it? Okay, arrive, negative contact, negative fucking contact. Private at order, reports visual sound, stage two, multiple infected contacts. Overrun, fell back to building interior, awaiting evac. Never got evac. So these guys died waiting for backup. Ugh. God damn it. Clicker. So that's what they're called? Jeez. What's wrong with his face? That's what years of infection will do to you. So what? Are they... Yeah. Fine? Sort of. Yeah. They see using sound. Like bats? Like bats. If you hear one clicking, you gotta hide. That's how they spot Jeez. I don't know if that would have been perfectly safe to touch that, but okay. I guess it's too late for that now. The building feels like it's about to fall apart. I wanted to play this in 2020, but you know, the whole thing about um, the world going to shit over a virus, I lost, <laughs> I lost the uh, the motivation Watch to play it that year, and then they announced the remaster, so it's just been. A long time coming. See, TV series is a must-see once I'm done with this game, not the second one. You mean the second game is not a must-see? Oh, that was intense. I don't have heals. Health kit required. Oh, you can craft alcohol and a rag. Shiv requires a blit. Oh, okay. You got supplements. To upgrade skills. Alright, so if I find supplements, they're for upgrades. The series is the one that follows the first game. I, I've heard that the second game was pretty divisive. Just in terms of, um, story. So, I don't know. I might check it out. Maybe one day, if there's enough interest in it or it gets requested appreciate it you like the story you didn't need the hate it got oh it didn't need the hate it got yeah i don't know i know nothing of it but sometimes people can be people. Things get unnecessary hate. It got hate? Yeah, I, I have friends that really don't like the second game. They were really disappointed in it. I know that's like grain of salt, but it, it's something that I've heard pretty frequently. You're not that I'm involved. Yeah, neither. Just, I guess, the topic of this show has come up numerous times. I mean, show, the game came up numerous times in conversations, so. I was always told, yeah, absolutely play the second game. The second game, I mean, the first game, the second game is something that you might not enjoy. Okay.
Just see if there's a way through. But, but yeah, this is one of these games that was just asked enough over the years. Like people saying they would love to see me play this. So I went for it. So it was less of an individual request and more of a, okay, I've heard about this game enough times. Come on, big guy. Let's go. If they work off... Oh, jeez. You know the scary thing about that is there is... <laughs> there are actually mushrooms that do that. Like they... They take over a host. Like, you know, Paris and Parasect in Pokemon, for example, that's mimicked off a real parasite that does that. Except to explain it more in the series. Okay. I'm fine. Let's go. This yeah. Blocked. See, that's part of the reason I don't want to play this game. It was just the premise of quarantine and um, curfews and that shit. It's just like, yeah, I was living with curfews and that sort of stuff in 2020. And would have had a little too close to home during that period. Like you couldn't be you couldn't be out beyond six PM. There you go, ladies. Alright. Unless you were doing what was it? It was like work for work for an essential service, pretty much. That was the only reason. Or going to give care to someone. Uh, this is crazy. And you had to have like proof that you were doing that. You don't have curfews. Yeah, we were the most strict lockdown city in the world. Um. Yeah. I experienced the brunt of it. <laughs> like, it did not get worse than what Melbourne had. In terms of lockdowns and curfews and all that shit. The longest lockdown lasted five months. It was, it was brutal. We got a way through. The only good thing that came of it is just this whole work from home thing. Yaga that China had one of the worst curfews. People weren't allowed to leave work. Okay, I wasn't aware of how China was uh, doing. Okay, revolver. Wait, what does it want me to press down to press revolver? Okay, that's all. I just knew that um, in terms of days in lockdown, ours was the highest. Like, maybe not the severity of the, uh, the curfew rules. Like, that's a whole separate thing. I don't think ours were that severe. It's more conceptually the days in lockdown it was practically a year. Oh 
Well, I don't, did it get bad that it wasn't until March? Um, probably March, yeah. I think our reaction was pretty much based on... Uh, the big event was there were these people coming home from China on a flight. And then because of that, that caused an infection. Okay, so am I supposed to be taking... I guess I'm supposed to be taking everyone out because we can't go forward. I don't think I can do this in a stealth manner. Oh, fuck. Got ya. It's okay. Sleep, sleep, sleep. I'm trying to conserve ammo because I'm going to need multiple shots to take things out. I mean, it was kind of wild. It was like one week we were reading about it. And just what was happening in China. And then, you know, suddenly they were talking about a case that had happened in Australia. And then, bam, the next week it was just, you know, immediately we had to start working from home. Like, we, would, we were in the middle of laying plans to start that process. And then, yeah, state government was like, all right, that's it. Lockdown. But, you know, the thing that would have just sucked about that, playing the game, this game in particular, is just, you know, I'm convinced if there's a way for things to go to shit, it's going to be purely because, heaven, for, heaven forbid, something um, inconvenience people's comforts and uh, just people making money. Okay, well, I took two shots. It's fine. Oh, shit. Ugh. That was gnarly. Alright, I tried. It was that, it was that, <laughs> it was that one that was standing there. I should have taken, I should have shot it whilst it was standing still. But yeah, let's not <laughs> go down the rabbit hole of that train of thought. Um, but this game would have been extremely difficult for me to play. Just on that foundation. Nope, not going past that one. I know that one's alive, so again, same thing, I'm gonna wait here. This is, yeah, this is the first year that has felt normal. Last year it was still half normal. But now it's, everything's, well, it's not the same. At least life is normal. <laughs> no more masks, yeah. Well, not just that, it's just... The thing that I dislike the most was just hearing people that this you know the conversation always start with i did my i did research it's like oh really you did research huh like our scientists or did you do a google search and then the a search engine that is um designed to look for the thing you're looking for you use that as uh reaffirming your point okay
I was playing Animal Crossing and started watching me then. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of wild, huh? Now that I think about it, it's like that get the only reason I played that game, I, I was interested in it, but it was just at the time. Wait, how do I stop to melee again? Okay, but hang on. I forgot on the button. How do you stop your melee weapon? It's fine, I'll stick to the bottle. I'll use it a... Yeah, I mean, I, I had a relative that um, tried to do that. At every gathering. Pretty much everyone was against that relative. And once he was trying to talk to me about it. And he was pulling out his phone. And I'm like, I swear, if you show me a Facebook... If you show me a Facebook post, I am leaving this room right now. What's wrong with Facebook? It's like, it's not a source of information. That's what's wrong with Facebook. It's like, it's like if I broke my leg and then you show me a Facebook post on how to fix said leg myself. That's how, that's how stupid it would be to use Facebook as a source of information. There's a reason there's only like a... Like, okay. In general, there's only a subset of the population that uses Facebook now. I'll just phrase it like that. <laughs> I don't want to accidentally carpet bomb here. If you use Facebook, that's fine. People use it to stay in touch with family, and it's just one of those things. The uh, the network effect is you have no choice but to use Facebook to stay in touch, because that's what family have picked. Nothing wrong with that. There's not... Why can't... That one's going to come to life. So I need to get rid of this one here. They don't see an issue with it. That's the problem. Yeah. It's okay. I think for me... There we go. Boomers. That's the thing. It's not boomers. I know people my age and younger that are on Facebook and... They just treat it as, as this thing that they just have to use. I don't know. It's definitely a, a boomer mentality, but... It's not exclusive to boomers. Okay. There we go. Is that it? I think we're okay now. Man. Press, Joel. Let's just get out of here. I need to craft another shiv. How do you do it? There we go. You wish they were that fast crouching. <laughs> yeah. My bones have started getting old, so... Not as agile as I used to be. Okay. Let's go. All right, hold on. 
Okay, there we go. I'm got <laughs> also gonna say welcome new chat member. Let's instead of reading that fully. That's a long ass username. With the word username in it. See? Doing alright. It's going alright, just checking this out. Even though this is a genre that I rarely play. Here, patch yourself up. What? I'm on full health. What do you mean? I'm fine. <laughs> okay. So we probably don't want to jump down. Down we go. Yeah, let's get to it. Wait, really? You get through here. No. Watch your back. First playthrough, yeah. So I'm keeping hints and anything to a bare minimum. Unless I utter the, the sentence, Hey chat, I, I am really stuck. Please help. But yeah, I mean, it's, it's pretty good so far. It's just... The thing I suck at is the shooting. I'm just not used to shooting with a controller. I don't do it often enough. You won't take it easy. Hey, you're the one always going on about laying low. And you always I'm enjoying the narrative so far. More than anything else. I think that's the reason I want to play it. Hmm. No mouse and keyboard. Well, the thing is, I can't remember if this game has been brought over to PC, but a lot of Sony exclusives are now being brought over to PC. So you could probably play this with mouse and keyboard. The shooting in this game takes some getting used to, especially with the sway. Yeah, I've definitely felt that a couple times, for sure. Um, just I'm aiming in a particular spot and then <laughs> it moves it. It's just, yeah, it's fine. Wait, no, but we went down this way on purpose. Alright, so where are we going? Hold on. Oh, there's another way up. Okay, got it. It has been released on PC. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, so it's one of these games that has been released on PC now. I'm playing this on the PS5, just for the record. Because my PC is old, and it's just not at the point where you can play these games well enough at a good quality. So, at least here, the the gameplay is offloaded to the PS5. Even though probably the PC would be the best way for me to play this, just from a control perspective. New PC for Christmas. I'm hoping a little bit before. I'm just waiting for... Intel's new processors to come out, um, which should be in the next month or two. And then, yeah, it's ready. It's time to do an upgrade. It's well overdue. Why is this here? Once I get that upgrade, then 1440p won't be a problem. I've been putting money aside for the last four months, maybe almost five now, just preparing for the new PC. May my fa frame rates be high and my temps slow. Thank you. Yeah. I will... I will definitely have to look into decent cooling. Okay, I thought I could jump, but it's not giving me the option. Being in Australia, that's the thing. Summer, man, particularly in this room I, I'm in, I usually stream with the door shut because then there's less less echo. Um, 
But in summer, I, I have to keep it open. Otherwise, it, it just becomes a boiler room. Okay, I'm kind of lost here. Hang on. It is almost midnight. <laughs> Sense of direction. I might be going to shit a little, so apologies if I'm going around in a circle. Oh. No window. Not that I can see. I didn't see what Tess want. Maybe it's just up here and I'm overcomplicating it. A window in the room that I'm in. Yeah, I, I got what you meant. I think it, I think this is it now. Maybe. No, this is the way I came back. Oh my god. <laughs> nice. Well done. She's down there. How the... the all right, I need to get down there. Is there a map? No, unfortunately. I mean, even a little, like, beacon. It's okay, I'll get used to it. It, ad it adds to the horror element, it's just being lost and... You know, helpless. But at least the characters stand around in the general direction you're supposed to be heading in, so there's that at least. If they're following me, that means I'm... Whoa, that was... <laughs> nice, nice slide. If they're following me, that means I'm headed in the right direction, so... At least there's that. Oh, oh, nice. Yep. Nice, nice, nice. That's good stuff. Yeah. Through here. I do appreciate that every now and then. It does reward you for a little bit of exploration. I'm just so glad there was GPS. If you had to learn to read a map, you'd be in trouble. I'd know how to read maps just because it's still part of an era that had them. But, you know, the nice thing about certain cities is the grid structure. Thankfully, where I live here in Melbourne, the entirety of the design of, uh, of the entire state is, is a grid. So you just head in the general direction of where you want to go, and, uh, you, you will eventually get there, so. Yep. These guys aren't doing well in or out of the city. Let's hope there's someone alive to meet us. <laughs> hey, Messiah. Let us all get bitten. You want to get bitten? I suppose if you want to be a zombie for Halloween, that's one way to do it. I can't climb that. Guess we'll... There's a note here. Meet up at the sec with the sec second Firefly team at the Capitol building. Capitol 
Gold Dome. Girl, 5'3", 14 years old, red hair. Oh, they're looking for her. Right. This way. You were told just don't cross any bridges. Luckily you're on an island, so as long as you don't cross a bridge, you'll find where you gotta get to eventually. <laughs> Here, I mean, everyone lives along the coast, so... I would imagine if shit went south, you would probably head into the middle of Australia. Even though it's a bit of a barren wasteland and survival might be a problem. The problem is we're our, we're our own continent, effectively, so... It's a positive and a negative. It's, it's easy to keep stuff out. But once something gets in, it's not getting out. <laughs> like, for example, we don't have rabies in Australia as a result, just because of how strong um, customs is. It's just not a thing here. What the fuck? I'm lost. Climb up here? You can't climb. Everything is just caved in. You can't read a map to save your life, man. Imagine just some catastrophic event causes maps to go down. I guess just go out this way. Maybe this was a... Oh, okay. Joel, you take point. I watch the I, No matter what, you stay right on his heels. Sure. You stay sharp. I got it. How many are there? Hang on. Uh, my day was good. Just happy that it's a weekend. There's multiple. This one's not quite converted yet. Jeez. Well, oh, there's still more. Holy shit, aiming is so hard. Okay, careful, careful. Oh my god. How did that miss? <laughs> Meleeing a click of brave. I was trying to save ammo because I know ammo is going to be a problem with me. I can't believe that got me. Like, oh. Yeah, see that. Jesus, Ellie, why are you running in front? <laughs> what the hell was that? She just ran- did you see that? She just ran in front of it. Um, let me, let me get this. Because this makes sound and I can probably use it to my advantage. Fuck it. 
Send in Ellie, she's a mute. <laughs> I mean, you know, that's... That's like saying, hey, Clark is wearing a bulletproof vent a vest. Let's just send them to deal with the tank. <laughs> He's got a bulletproof vest on. He can deal with that tank. How did the rest of the infected not detect me? I fired a gun. Yes. Oh yeah, no, stealth, stealth is my, my middle name. I mean, am I not supposed to melee the big mushroom head ones? Where is that coming from? Clicker. Okay, there it is. It isn't about being able to melee them, just can't risk getting that close to them yourself. That's fair. I mean, realistically, you shouldn't be anywhere near some of this shit. Like, I just ripped one of them off a door before, and, um... Yeah, that's probably not the best thing, to touch the thing that has caused a, a worldwide infestation. <laughs> It's just, I think, guns should be reserved for just situations where I have no other alternative. Like, I have to shoot from a distance to deal with them. Oh, no, that, the quick turn fucked me. Okay, stop crouching for one. I hate how it auto crouches. Okay, let's just. <laughs> it alerts the horde. Jesus, Ellie. Okay. The dad's dead. Alright, we're fine. <laughs> what do I usually stream? Uh, pretty much a bit of everything. But earlier today I was playing Sea of Stars, yesterday I played Pikmin, and Warrior Land. Also been playing Animal Crossing. Just, I have a bit of everything. I'm guessing for this I need to have found a piece of information first. I think here. Yeah. yeah, it's just... The easiest way to find out, like, what I've played. I think I still have this command. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> hey, the bot still has it. But I upload all my streams to YouTube, so those playlists show everything I've played lately. Alright, where are we headed? That thing looked disgusting. Yeah, and the scary thing is it's kind of based off, like, a real life thing. In nature, there are these... There's this parasite that latches onto an animal, a particular type of animal, and then it basically kills it and takes its brain eventually. 
So, you know, this is a case of what if that happened to humanity. Cordyceps, yes, that. I don't know the scientific term. Ants, there you go. Bugs. Someone will be better at telling that lore than me. I just know that. That's all I know about this game, more or less, is... It's based off of what if that shit happened to humans? That's no different than a zombie movie. Yes. Let's move. You guys are pretty good at this stuff. The thing is, for the first couple well, for the first hour of this game, there wasn't really much interaction with these things, so it's like on and off. I was fighting a gang first up. To where we going, Tess? Uh Capitol buildings in this direction. You missed the best part. Yeah, the part where I was failing immensely, yes. Because I was just not used to the shooting and failed the tutorial, yes. Let's see what we can find. Gotten a little more accustomed to it now. Okay. Cordyceps and mushrooms are not parasite or bug, but it will infect bugs like ants to control them into higher spots where the mushroom can spread. Gotcha. Well, there you go. Can I make it move? Oh, there was another one to the right. I appreciate this aspect of it, though. And, hang on. Not that. Damn it, dude. And then that. We need more. Oh, shit. There's another one coming around here. I'm going to try and take out this one. Nature is ter terrifying. It is. This is like the walking dead. Yeah, I mean, the whole thing is... is uh, it's that scenario. It's a zombie apocalypse. Just not like... How you think. Okay, this is interesting. They vacated the building. Why'd you climb up here? We'll be fine. This was the correct choice. It can't affect humans because our body temperature is too high. In the series, they explain that. Thanks to global warming, the mushrooms evolved and could withstand our temperature. Right, gotcha. Which means there's more in the area. We gotta go. Ah, global warming. Actual science. Yeah. Sorry, I don't just don't think about it too much. If I end up liking this game as a whole and I'm done with it, you recommend the DLC which comes with it. Yeah, I'll at the very least try the DLC since it's on here. The second game, I guess it depends how much people want to see that. I tend to go with popular demand sometimes. Unless I am just that enthralled by it that I want to check out the second one. But I have heard a bunch of mixed things about it. We'll see how it go. The problem is there's just so much stuff coming out now. Like, 
at the end of the month, the Spider-Man 2 and the new Mario game that I want to play, so... That's in two weeks' time. I saw a gun icon. I swear I saw a gun icon for... Yeah, there. There we go. That's what I was looking for. Okay, so... I was supposed to use this to get us across, but... Here we go. I think I kind of... I don't know if what I did helped, but it caused one checkpoint, and then... I guess it was easier to deal with that. It may have helped, it may not have helped. Climb on up. There have been mushrooms that have actually evolved to a standard temperature and is currently a problem in India. Doesn't make them crazy, but very also. Yeah. I'm just not gonna think about that. <laughs> there's there's a lot of a lot of things that could happen in nature and in just where we sit in the universe. That could bring our undoing, and it's best just to not think about that. Like, you know. Hold on. Okay, double time. Coming. I know. Get it let's get go. Oh, damn. Cool. You got something on your shoe. A hand. <laughs> Ignorance is bliss, pretty much. Okay. How do we get out of this place? I had a teacher say, you know, that if the sun farted, we'd all be doomed. So just don't worry about the sun farting. <laughs> That's what she believes. Well, how were you bitten? I mean, you must have been somewhere you shouldn't to find an infected zone. Yeah, I, I'd sneak out. I was in this military boarding school. I'd sneak I, out. We want something that has accuracy. I was in the mall when I ran into infected. The one that has high capacity, reload speed, capacity, fire rate. Anyways, Probably. Oh, I only have twelve. I can't upgrade. That was that. I see. <laughs> you fear unlocked. You uh, that's fine. No, I went to her for help afterwards. So I no can't. I don't. Ugh, I didn't find enough upgrade parts. That sucks. Hope she's all right. Unless there's one behind me somewhere. It's gonna be fine. Just made you think of the Teletubbies sun baby farting. <laughs> Oh, that show. Jeez. I, I hated the Teletubbies. It just felt so cursed. Um, well, I don't have enough upgrade parts, so it doesn't matter. Unfortunately, I just... I'm short three. We had Teletubbies there. Yeah, what Teletub... Correct me if I'm wrong. Unless the dub, they dubbed it, but weren't the Teletubbies British, originally? I might be wrong, maybe it was just a localization thing. I'm looking around and seeing if there's any parts, but I don't think there are. I think I just gotta look more. Did they even talk? Uh, there was a narrator. That's why I associated with British, there was a British narrator. The Teletubbies just made sounds, which... There was a lot of studies that were showing that those kind of shows are bad for children. It's better to... Have shows that speak to children like they're adults, as opposed to just making random ass noises. It was a British show. Haha! -ha! Useless trivia! <laughs> I don't know why I know that. 
different language for every region you imagine. Yeah. It's just when it comes to Australia, um, like they don't bother typically. So if the show originates in the US, they'll keep the American accents. And if it originated in the UK, they keep the British accents. So that's why I was convinced it was uh, British because yeah, of that. Like they just never, they rarely do Australian voice acting. They're just like, oh, they speak English. Yeah, that's fine. Just keep it as is. Fancy. Not the room, but just there's a lot of antiques in here. Jesus Sorry. Christ, Ali. <laughs> Sorry. Stay close to me. <laughs> that kind of got me because of my headphones, like it was just loud in one side. Oh. Hey, I just noticed something. My bot is not announcing the follows. Why not? Oh, I'm going to have to look into that. Shit. Well, thank you for the follow. <laughs> Usually the bot makes an announcement, so then I'd know, but I just noticed it hasn't been doing that. Why not? Alright, I'll look into it after the stream. It's broken. Well, it, it responded to me when I wrote a command. Like, if I did this right, it worked. I think maybe the Twitch side of it might be broken. Did it announce my stream when I went live on Discord? Let's see. Yeah, it did. Weird. Yeah, I don't know. The bots need a race. <laughs> the siege on Boston. Ah, American history. It's a triangle. You haven't been getting notifications from Twitch that I've been on. Ah, well, that's that's a Twitch problem. But if you have Discord on your phone and you want to get notifications right away from Discord, um, you can enable them by typing exclamation notify in my Discord server, and then the bot will add you to a group and you'll get a ping from Discord. And that one's... Th that one's more accurate. It, it, it pretty much does it within the minute. I'll make my way around. Look, they're here! Tess, run. I don't know how that's possible. Oh, good. I like being on my own. That's fine. Do you reckon if I dress up like, um... Like, someone from colonial times, they'll be like, oh, it's just a, a statue. That's fine. And they'll leave me alone. Like, if I just take this this outfit here and just stand still. Okay, is that it? If that, is that a fully fledged one? Oh shit, okay. Be accurate, don't panic. <laughs> Fuck. Ah, oh, damn it. They're blind. Well, I didn't know it was I didn't know it was a clicker, but now I know it's a clicker. I'm just gonna have to take them head on. This one this is a scenario where I got a headshot, alright. Oh fuck me, there's multiple. 
Oh, it was still alive. <laughs> okay, well. I'm just eating my potato chips. Fuck, how am I going to get out of this one? Wait, I can't go back in the way I... I... Oh, that is just a dick move of a game design. That's what I was trying to do. I was trying to crawl into my little spot again. I guess the answer here is just to not fight. Tess. Tess. Shit. Do you put notify anywhere? Or is it a specific spot? I mean, I can add you to the group manually if you don't want to type it, but... It's, and it should be anywhere, and then the bot will message you and be like... Hey. You did it. Uh, what flavor and brand? Kettle and the... It's just the brand is Kettle in Australia. They're Kettle cooked chips, and then it's a chili flavor, so it's like... Salty, and it says it has jalapeno in it, so it's my favorite. It's just very salty and a little bit of spice. It pairs pretty nicely with beer, but I, mean, I don't have beer. Um, I should try and make a shiv. Not that. I have two shivs, but I might need another. It didn't run in there. I know it did, it did, it did, it did, it did. Okay, okay. I think the name of the game here is just don't fight. This is stupid to fight. The bot didn't like it and didn't say anything, really? Uh, let me see. Oh no, you got the roll. Yeah, no, it's it's given you it because your name is in a is in a very light blue. If you notice on Discord, so that means you got added correctly. It did add you. I just guess it didn't send you the message. So now when I go live, Discord should ping you. I just checked. It definitely did it. As long as you have mobile notifications on. Wait. Okay, this is just a normal one. I'm guessing they're holed up in there. I hear them. Oh, shit. Jeez. Guys, get in here! Oh no. I can't grab him. Oh my god. Okay, no, fighting's not the answer. As long as long as there's as long as there's not clickers. Okay. Pull out the gun. Be ready. It's fine. You are fine. It's a good thing there's no concept of stamina. Ah! Hey, how's it going? <laughs> as long as there's, there's no concept of stamina, I'll keep doing this.
Okay. What? We'll see our shit about. I'm just looking around, just in case there's parts. I should be looking. I don't want to go too far off the rails here, but... I've been neglecting scavenging a little bit. You know, now that I think about it, I have not played a horror game in a very long time. The last one I tried for a little bit was... which Resident Evil was it? It was a Resident Evil game, and the only reason I tried it was because, uh, it was the VR version, or they had VR support. <laughs> Fucking hell, that- ooh, that shit is something else. When you have, uh, a headset on and shit's running towards you, and it feels like you're there. Stand back. That was, uh, the experience I last had with a horror game. Would have been like five years ago, maybe more. Where are we going? We're going, we're going across here, right? Yeah. It is spooky season horror game month. I don't typically do it though. Like the other years, I've just played something like Castlevania, which it, it's just that's more, I guess, it's Halloweeny, but not horror. Just has gothic vibes to it. But this, yeah, yeah, I decided, ah, let's do this. Do we have haunted houses there to go to? Um, abandoned properties, yes. And it's not legal to go there, but there are definitely properties that, you know, through urban stuff, um, they were considered haunted houses, and it's just... Trespassing, technically. Yes, ma'am. As for, like, official stuff, no. Scare actors, yes. There have been a few experiences that pop up here and there that do that. Ghosts are real? I don't think they are, but... It's right around this corner. Come on. It's just... I'm just saying, like, uh... You hear about the supposed haunted house through school, and then... You know... You and friends drive down there, and you go in and have a look. Um, the only official one I've been to is, so there's a decommissioned prison in the island state. Uh, so they have like a, a ghost tour, I guess. Which, they just go around the old prison and tell stories about certain prisoners that used to be detained here, and... Yeah. That's that's about the extent that I've seen that sort of stuff. Go. Home stretch, Tess. Australia's got quite a few of those because uh, Australia was effectively a prison originally. <laughs> um, they sent all their convicts down here from from the UK, or I don't know what it was classified as back then, Britain, I guess. Just so it's out there, I can't swim. Look, it looks like it's shallow on the right side. Follow me. 
So they had a lot of penitentiaries here. I know you guys are getting paid for this, but I'm trying to say this. Yeah, sure thing. Massachusetts, okay. Well, I know where that is, at least. I might not be good with American geography, but I know where that is, at least. That would explain the museum. No. No, no, no. See, I, I like horror that's more um, psychological and just... You know, not sh necessarily showing the thing to be afraid of. That's the kind of horror I like. More of a fear of the unknown thing. When it comes to modern horror, it just tends to lean more on the side of just grossing you out as opposed to actually scaring you. She never said. She only mentioned that it was. So I'm enjoying this so far. It's like the kind of horror that I I, I dig. This is not us. What do you know about us? About me. I know that you are smarter than this. Really. Guess what? We're shitty people, Joel. It's been that way for a long time. No, we are survivors. This is our chance. It is over, Tess. Now we tried. Let's just go home. I'm not. I'm not going anywhere. Oh shit. This is my last stop. What? What? Oh, she got infected. I'll have to run out sooner or later. Keep going all. No, don't. Don't touch me. Holy shit. She's infected. Oh, but you were carrying me. Let me see. I didn't mean for this. Show it to me. Have I played until dawn? I have not. Oh, shit. <sighs> Oops. Right? Give me your arm. This was three weeks. I was bitten an hour ago, and it's already worse. This is fucking real, Joel. You've got to get this girl to Tommy's. He used to run with this crew. He'll know where to go. No, no, no. no. That was your crusade. I am not doing that. Yes, what I, uh... There's enough here that you have to feel some sort of obligation to me, so you get her to Tommy's. Maybe. <sighs> the, pro the problem They're is... Here. I can buy you some time, but you have oh. to... You want us to just leave you here? Yes. Consider this. I have two weeks to finish this. And, um... Sea of Stars. Then Mario and Spider-Man. Then Mario RPG. No, no, it's pretty go. much non-stop for the next month or two. If not more. Ellie. Eventually, yeah. I'll, I'll 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 keep it in mind, just like I kept this in mind, and I eventually got to it. Mario and Spider Man Two are on the same the same day. I didn't say Mario Spider Man, did I? I may have. It's it's past midnight. My English is uh probably down the drain. Stop. She was gonna die. We have to move. Oh man. Oh, okay. That sucks, but I kind of expected it. Maybe next Halloween. Maybe. Words are hard. Oh shit. See this that's the kind of horror I like is just you heard what happened in the background there. Just keep pushing forward. And then silence, like, fuck. That's heavy shit. Love it. That's the kind of stuff I like. Target neutralized. She took out two of my men. Copy that. You, take out the door. You, with me. Yes, sir! And then you look down and... Yeah... They're gonna be here soon. No, English is an annoying language. 
Today will not be cozy stream. It was really cozy earlier with Sea of Stars. That game was great. The pixel art and the story. Love it. But you're admittedly right now, no. But it's like you're watching a movie. <laughs> How did I not get spotted? Oh, fuck. Please go away. Oh, no, yeah, no, that's, that's fine. Does he actually see me? Well, I'm kind of cornered here. What the fuck? <laughs> Wait a minute, look at him. He's going down the stairs and then comes up the stairs the, me the moment I come up. Okay, it's fine. <laughs> it's alright. There is nothing to see here, sir. Just turn around and go about your business. I think I have to, I have to fight, fuck. The moment I fire that shot, they're gonna come barging in here. I'm not moving, I'm just. Why is he letting me do this? What the hell? Okay. Now what? Do I have any... <sighs> oh God. Oh, that killed me. I'm putting a marker so I can get a clip of that later. Shit. Oh, oh now you pull out the gun! <laughs> Yeah, AI, yeah. Good AI. Oh, for fuck's sake, there's another one already, though. I'm hoping they're just a bunch of lemmings and just line up right here to die. Twin brother down. I need to go see their bodies and see if they have bullets. Oh, oh yes! Oh. Okay, hold on. Oh, fuck me. Ellie, back, Ellie! <laughs> why, why is there no... Why is there no combat... Combat roll. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Give me a sec. Swap weapon. Give me the one with more ammo. Don't turn around. Don't turn around. Nothing to see right here. Don't turn around! <laughs> Motherfucker. Really? Christ. Let's just... 
not. I can't believe he turned around just right before I was about to grab him. Okay, okay, we're good, we're good. That dude's face is missing, but otherwise we are okay. <laughs> now teabag them. It's a little rude. Okay, I do have, uh, listen, mode, distance, crafting speed, weapon sway. Oh no, yeah, that, that's what we want. I'm saving up for that shit. Hang on, give me a sec. Speaking of the temperature getting warmer, I need to open the door now. There we go. Ugh. It do be spring. Sniper rifle. You were going to suggest weapon sway earlier, but wasn't sure about how I felt about tips. Uh, if it's something that, let's say, because I'm only a few hours into this, if it's something that it's been like six, I don't want to put an arbitrary number, but just a certain amount of time and it's just, okay, he hasn't figured it out, then it's fine. But if it's something that I'll discover naturally on my own, yeah, it's less necessary. But I do appreciate the help. How hot is it there now? I mean, it's nighttime. It's not that hot. It's just the room got warm. Um, yeah, it's actually pretty cool outside. It's just in here, it's a bit warm. At least this will be good for scouting. Alright, um, let me... Oh, there you go, okay. I see. What do we do? Joel. Great. I got this. I'm not sure if the remake has the option to turn swing off in the settings rather than waste pills on it. Hmm. I guess let's see. Excuse me, why would it... Are you kidding? Oh my god, yes. Fuck yes. Okay, this might be a big quality of life thing. Maybe. We'll see how we go, but... Gyro aim is, is really good, generally speaking. Adapter triggers on, bow resistance. Mm, doesn't seem to be here. Oh my god. Yep, this is this is better. Cause I can I can move with the analog stick and then this is like adjusting. Okay, it's a it's a little better. It's a little better. Okay. Hello, friend. <laughs> no, I do appreciate the settings. It's clear. What do you mean it did, did... I saw that someone got vision of me, on me. So did this dude just give up? <laughs> Fine. Oh no, he's right ahead. Okay, I see. And then there's another dude over there. Okay, let's just... Right. I don't know if there's a smart way to do this. Hang on. I think the name of the game here is Patience. I love the logic that these dudes follow. It's just like, we're trying to track someone down. 
Let's yell, so then they know where we are. It's just as bad as when someone's following you and they're like, Shh, be quiet, they'll hear you! It's like, yes, just shut up, we're in stealth. <laughs> Stay with me, come on. Ellie is not doing that, so I appreciate that a lot. Oh my god, in, in cyberpunk. Fucking Jackie. Hey man, be quiet, they'll hear us. Get down! Get ready to grab! <laughs> okay. It's like these guards have zero peripheral vision. All right. All right, come on, Ellie. Right behind you. Okay. Nice. Hell yeah. Alright, I'm gonna have a look around just in case there's upgrade parts in these rooms. Huh. The game isn't like this, the guards are more aware. I mean, I did pick the standard difficulty. I didn't do hard, but this isn't easy. I definitely didn't pick easy, I went with just normal. The middle difficulty. Because what it's like, hold on. Yeah. So, that's what I picked. Wow, that's kind of nice, you can... So, it's in the middle, it's just... I don't know. You play on the easiest difficulty and they're more aware than this. Well, here's the thing about when I play games. When I play games, I have... just this passive ability where games seem to just glitch out or... just give me a pass. <laughs> When they really shouldn't. So it could, it could be that, but I don't know. Why am I crouched? But yeah, I mean, there's my difficulty screen. I'm not... I'm not on a dumbed-down difficulty by any means. I picked this one because it was balanced, so it was just nice difficulty in storytelling. Well, I guess let's go on. Do you like it when I break games? Yeah, that's... that's funny. Something that only started happening when I started streaming. What are we doing? Joel, how are we gonna get out of here? Shh. Patience. We're gonna go through that hall. Stay down, I don't know how many more there are. Used to happen to you if Crash Bandicoot would survive when you shouldn't. Which Crash Bandicoot? The original trilogy or the remakes that they made? Or Crash Bandicoot 4? I know there are other games, but <laughs> come on, let's be real. <laughs> the, all the games in that series that people talk about are the original trilogy and 4. The original trilogy back on the PS1 days. It was a good trilogy. You could get away with a lot of things. The... I don't know what I'm going to do here. Okay, well... Get behind the door. Wait for him. My bad. Oh, 
Don't lose it. Yeah, the Unsane trilogy was jank to say. Right here. How did you see me? How the fuck? Okay. <laughs> they have a voice line for that. Come here. I'm gonna play around with this. I like fucking with the AI, see how smart it is. Keep them occupied. I see Oh my god. I had to. I had to. Crouch. Reload. Yeah, I'm not sure. It must have been like a weird line of sight thing, technically. I think now they're all aware that I'm here. So I probably won't be able to get away with sneaking through. Okay. Wait for him. Wait for him to crouch. If he did it, just give it a sec. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Ellie! <laughs> Jeez. You know, it's a good thing they don't detect Ellie. Okay. That was almost a mistake. Oh shit. Shit. That's right, kid. Shit indeed. To the shadows. I think the other one's gonna come over here, so let's just chill for a minute. I might follow him into that room. Oh, God. Okay, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Don't turn around. All good. I like this predator mode. <laughs> It's just, this is the sort of thing where you see in a horror movie. There's like this alien creature that has heat vision. I love how they, that dude didn't turn around despite hearing us talk. Okay. All right, we can breathe now. Binoculars would be nice to take. If I could. Okay. I mean, I feel like I'm not looking at the areas pretty in-depth. I'm not exactly scavenging as much as I should be. I 
I'm sure it's fine. Like, I'm sure if I don't get many upgrades, I should be able to get through the game. Um, will probably be difficult, but... I'm sure it's by no means mandatory. Given there are difficulties that make resources scarce. Good idea. Stay low. Glad I thought of it. Probably a, a first mistake. There's a soldier over there. Hold your position and wait for reinforcements. Copy that. Who the hell are you breathing in this stuff? I wasn't lying to you. Oh shit. Did you spot him? No. Right, yeah. I didn't see anything. Search the area. Find them and get the hell out of here before any clickers show up. Okay, I need to go for the one in the train first. Or not, no longer in the train. I mean, I guess this is completely optional. I would assume that they could see flashlights, so that's why I didn't turn it on. Hey, uh, I can't swim. Really? We'll figure something out. Oh no. Alright. In Australia, everyone gets taught to swim. <laughs> Like, it's part of our school curriculums. Particularly learning about what to do with reptides. Now, I'm not sure if it's a result of, uh... Just because of what happened in Australia with, uh, one of our leaders who drowned as a result of a reptide, but I would probably take a guess that that's why they did it. Just making sure everyone's well educated on that sort of shit. Oh, I can dive on the water. Damn. That looked really visually nice. Can I grab onto anything yet? Or is this just a stopgap? Okay, this should be fine now. Early. Have I gone too far? I'm fine. Oh, not. Oh, not. <laughs> okay. Why didn't we go... You know what? It's fine. Why didn't we go the way she did? Hey, look. It still works. 
your contact is a dude named Frank. He's the guy on the outside I've been trading with. He wants into Boston QZ. Meet him in the Park Street exit of the subway, right by the Capitol building. Attached is his visa and QZ papers. You like that handiwork? Be careful down there. Some of my other guys are reporting clickers and stalkers in the area. What the hell is this guy? I've been waiting here over two hours, sweating bullets. I keep thinking I'm seeing something move in the shadows. Feels like a stalker is going to jump out at me any second now. I'm giving him another 15 minutes and then head back. Well. Yeah. You're not going to leave me here, right? Just stay put. I'm not going anywhere. Okay. Where is he? Ooh. Anything else I can take advantage of here? Not really. This must not be the best smell. I'm a little disoriented down there. Go back down. Okay. Hey, what you got? Anything down there? It's a dead end. There's a Maybe we can do that. Okay. How does... I, I, I can't believe I'm saying this. I kind of like climb on this pipe. Like, surely you should be able to grab this. You'd be able to get a foot on this and, gra and climb up. Like, I'm pressing X. It's not doing anything. But, I mean, realistically speaking... <laughs> You should be able to get your footing on that. <laughs> Challenge the player. Fuck logic. Oh, there you go. Oh, no, yeah, that makes sense. So, just for the sake of involving the kid. We have to use this and ferry her across. She grabs the ladder. Yes, make the player build a connection to the child. Really? Really. Okay, okay. Don't jump, just walk on. <laughs> it was right at the edge. I got you. Alright, go. Get the ladder. Get the ladder! <laughs> she won't get the ladder. What am I doing? What was the difference between there? Because the ladder was in her way? There's an invisible wall now. I can't move. Look. The ladder's already here. <laughs> okay, there we go. Oh, you're good. <laughs> I'm just gonna check the lockers real quick. Anything of note? Not really. Okay. I'm fully expecting to get attacked any any second now. You know, one does 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 does, does no action that, that can be cozy. It's just like watching a movie. 
It's just when there are disgusting things happening, then yeah, that's when admittedly that vibe dies. <coughs> hey, look, um, about Tess, I, I don't even know what... Here's how this thing's gonna play out. You don't bring up Tess, ever. In fact, we just keep our histories to ourselves. Second, Jeez. Don't tell anybody about your condition. They think you're crazy. They'll try to kill you. And lastly, you do what I say, when I say. Who's Tess? Uh, the lady that Clear? got bitten. Sure. Repeat it. And sacrificed herself. What you say goes. Good. Uh, now there's a town. A few miles north of here, there's a fella there that owes me some favors. Good chance he could get us a car. Okay. Let's get a move on. I'm guessing that's the end of Act 1. First act done. <laughs> yeah, it'll be faster to go through here. <sighs> What? Nothing, it's just... I've never seen anything like this, that's all. You mean the woods? Yeah. Never walked in the woods. It's kind of cool. <laughs> I'm just waiting for this dialogue to be over. Okay. We're gonna to to take an intermission at this point. I'm not done with the stream. I just want to split the video on YouTube. chances of survival weren't too high to begin with. But also, I need to uh, just take a small, small break. Two to five minute intermission. I'm just waiting for this dialogue tree to be over. But if you've reached the end here on YouTube, thanks for tuning in and hope you've been enjoying the playthrough of it so far, despite the start of it being a little rocky <laughs> with my gameplay. But I think it's smoothed out now, hopefully. Anyway, if you want to support the channel, just click buttons like the like button or... Uh, just watch any of the other two videos that have popped up. But yeah, till next time, bye YouTube.